going on everybody welcome back so I'm gonna make this uh, hopefully a quick update everything's uh, still going pretty good um, had a lot of uh, algae growing on the glass but I just took a um, phosphate test and it's showing zero I used a Hanna checker it's not an ultra low level Hanna checker but it's still should be pretty decent it's showing zero um, I did move some rock around uh, a few days ago. That might be the case. Um, I don't know why, but I had a good bit of algae grow um, on the glass in about two, three days. Uh, usually my old tank deprived of all the phosphate and nitrate. I mean, it, w it would be about a week until I would see that much algae, so that kind of concerned me a little bit. Um, I did have a water change ready, but after taking the phosphate test, I'm going to let it go for another week and see how that goes but I basically I'm trying to keep this whole thing as simple as possible uh, if you watch my other videos the last tank had a lot of stuff going on the uh, in the sump the skimmer um, no pox was dosed every day and uh, used Roafoss and believe that was basically just depriving a lot of nutrients out so this time I'm trying to keep this very simple um, and then I did dose other things trace elements and uh, you know calcium two part in the last tank um, doing the same thing here but I'm kinda going by a new strategy just trying to um, dose a little bit less than anything any of the directions uh, require so and basically what I've got it down to is, um, and right now, I'm just dosing this, these three products. And I'm going to leave it that way. As I do notice, um, I am getting growth on the coral uh, pretty good. I don't know if I can squeeze in there. And then my, my local fish store has great prices. Um, Usually every frag in here is either twenty dollars or less, except for that maybe that uh, Gregorian that was about thirty five dollars, which I thought was a uh, photosynthetic, and the guy there told me it was, but I'm having a suspicion that that's not a photosynthetic Gregorian, and only time will tell if it can survive. Um, hopefully it can. Got a new rock flower anemone, an um, and a new uh, yellow coarse grass everything else is doing pretty good and I noticed some growth on um, got a new bird's nest growth on the, some of the, the bird's nests and the uh, Manipura um, which usually that growth I, I usually don't see until maybe about four to six months into uh, some of my reef tanks when they're established pretty good so I'd say overall everything in this planned out system is going um, good as is expected uh, uh, for somebody who's I guess been doing it as long as I have maybe not as long as most or a lot of people but about three to five years somewhere in there but so far um, the calcium I take about half a cap of this for this 25 gallon system and uh, I put that in my auto top off in my five gallon bucket auto top off and then whenever it's time to change the uh, auto top off then I add a another about a cap cap and a half or just half a cap maybe three-fourths of a cap of the uh, carbonate two-part and then I also add a cap of this strontium molly Bynum, yep, for I guess the algae scrubber or the, the Chato reactor. I'm sorry. Um, and the Chato reactor has slowed down, and I suspect that might be because of the low uh, phosphate, but it's still cranking. I did um, empty it out, but it's still going. It's, I mean, it's still alive. And I'm hoping it'll stay that way. And I'm just going to keep it going. The protein skimmer has... It took three weeks for this thing to break in. Usually a lot of my protein skimmers 
start going right at about a week but that thing is cranking out and it's doing really good and I had the other protein skimmer that I bought but it actually didn't fit in the back so I'm stuck with the eShop's uh, nano skimmer which I I personally every time I get an eShop skimmer it's it skims like a champion I mean, you can see it's pulling out some dark stuff and that would probably fill up halfway in about two days two three two to four days let's say but everything else is doing pretty good a new feather duster too you can see there that Monty's kinda starting to encrust on that rock so it's, it's, it's starting to go so that's about it alright thanks for watching